<laughs> Subscribe to Kittoons and let the never ending fun begin! <laughs> Yeah, it's a beautiful cape. Oh. Whose might it be? Wow! A white swan! Every day you'll live a tale, and with the story, a new book will prevail. Storyland, the world of stories! Wow. Part 2! Where are we? Will the red-caped baby be here? Mm -hmm. Huh? Who's the baby? Hi! Oh! Are you new here? Ah. Ouch. Ouch. Ouch! Ouch! I'm missing something here. A red-caped baby. Who are you? Your basket! <gasps> My red cape! <laughs> The, the baby, baby we were, were looking, looking for. I made one with pieces of fabric, but it's not the same. The red one is unique. It's made out of some fabrics that can only be found once every thousand years. Oh, ah! Thanks, thanks. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm Scarlet. Hmm? Storyland's famous designer. Mm -hmm. Scarlet. Does uh, she sound familiar to you? Mm -hmm. Not me. Are we in a tale? I cannot tell. But where huh? do you come from? Mm. I'm famous. I only have one client now because uh, I get distracted and deliver the mm. orders late. But I have to sign some cool <laughs> clothing. Look, uh, and my basket? Oh no, I've lost it. Uh, uh, I must go. I have to make new clothing and deliver oh. before the third bell rings. Or I'll lose my only client. Where did I leave it? Mm. Wait, it flew away that way. Oh no, aha, uh -huh. wait. Not here, not here. Where did the basket fall? The basket you will not find. But together, let's use our mind. Ugh, goodness, I'm exhausted. But no way. Uh -oh. There's no time left and no material to design the clothing. I'll lose my only client. <laughs> no worries. You have us and a cape made out of pieces of material. We'll transform it into beautiful clothing. Really? You're the best. Follow me. Mm-hmm. Did you hear that? And this is how we do it. Oh. I want to help. What can I do? I know huh? how to do this. Oh. Ah. Wow. How do you do it? You fly. I have a friend called Peter who knows how to do it too. My wolf loves it. What? What? Is there a wolf? Yes, her name is Kara. She likes to eat a lot. Such a beast. <laughs> wolf will be and into your arms will flee. Into my arms? She will eat me! Hey, the scraps! But where are you going? Such an excuse for not sewing. What a cool game! Scarlet, don't get distracted or we'll never finish on time. The bells! Okay, okay, let's see. First, we draw the patterns. Then, we place the scraps over them. And last to sew! Already. Yeah, great! Ow. Ow. Huh? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> ah, the wolf! Aww, oh. but you're a cute little wolf! <laughs> Kara, you found it in time! <laughs> Piggy will have two outfits! I'm here! Let me see it. Oh, wow, it's perfect! The cape! I remember now. It's the cape from Scarlet's fairy tale, Little Red Riding Hood. Oh, oh it's true. It's real. <laughs> Thanks a million, Scarlet. You'll see me wearing it soon. And there are two. I Page love that. Got, got it. it. <laughs> yes. The party you went on too late. Look how she sleeps. I feel sorry to wake her up. What if we leave a farewell note? Yes. Oh, huh? babies. Wait, you can't leave. I've designed something special for you. Wow, <gasps> they're beautiful. Thanks. How cool. It's just that you've inspired me very much. I just needed a bit of direction. I made these outfits for when you come back to Storyland to live more adventures. You're the best. Thanks, Thanks Scarlett. Scarlett. Storyland Magic Tears. And this is 
how Scarlet, with focus and inspiration in mind, designed and delivered clothes one of a kind. Wow! Where do you come from? Wow, what beautiful clothing! I think we'll have many adventures with these outfits. He was bound to fail. Aye, aye. Ouch. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dreamy. What's going on? It's coming. Yeah. The strong wind. The shelter. Hey, calm down. I'm Piggy. The strong wind is about to arrive. Every year, my two brothers and I build a shelter in order to protect the statue. But they have a cold. <clears throat> and I have to do it by myself. And what happens if you don't finish it? That the wind will take away the most mm. valuable thing of our world. It'd be a disaster. And I'm trying, but it's just that by myself. Poor Piggy. And you hurt your arm from carrying so much. You're not alone. Professionals, we've grown. We'll stop the wind. Sure thing. Oh, you also have a cold. Together, we'll build it in a flash. We'll build, build the shelter. shelter. Let's go. We'll need cement, gravel, sand, and bricks. Yeah, yeah bricks. By little, like my brothers say, brick by brick, we build a castle so quick. Let's go, babies. A little more that way, more here. Oh no, watch out, Dottie. Uh, time stands still. Oof. Let it continue. Huh? huh? Where's my brick? This team is very slow. At this pace, the wind will blow. If only they weren't so heavy. And if the cement wasn't so sticky. Ouch! And if there weren't shovels. I got it. What if we build it out of straw? But yeah! yeah. See? We'll do it faster this way. But faster doesn't mean... <laughs> It'll hold up. You were right. The straw wasn't that... Nice! It's easier to carry. And cooler. We'll build an igloo for the statue. We need more ice. ice. Yes! <laughs> a lot of ice! Yeah! yeah. But... And the rest of the block? They melted with the sun. I know, it's not easy. But we need to do it right. Otherwise, the strong wind will blow the statue away. And the effort will be useless. Piggy, we'll listen to everything you say. Yes, yes let's, let's go! go. We'll get it this time! Hmm. <laughs> this is the song of the strong wind And we came together to work and sing Because our <laughs> world is a special place And we have to protect this beautiful space With hard work and determination Important 
is that we made a big effort, and at the end, it all turned out well. So many bricks of ice cream. Oh, what a scheme. It seems like a dream. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Land Magic Tears! And that's how Piggy, with effort and determination, so brave took on strong wind, from which the world he did save. For this tale will live on, and the wind will behave. energy. A one, two, three, and... There were three explorer babies who dreamed of a colorful world. A big tree! It's a sign! It took the babies to another land, and they, they discovered a world under the rainbow. It came out of its roots, and a big crack opened, and Fantasy World was in danger. The pink baby tried to save us, and with her board... Not board. Oh? You're singing it wrong. Sword. It's with her sword. There's not much difference. And with her sword, she tried to close it. But she disappeared and came back to her world. It's the baby sword song. Everything has to be perfect. Let's hear the backup singers. Pink, green, and blue. And then the other colors that we're going to find. It doesn't matter where you are. I can see you, you can see me. This is our greatest power. Again, from the top. I need a break, and I'm thirsty. Ugh, nap time. You don't get it. It's a very special song. Hmm, huh? Hmm. No breaks until you know it by heart. I'm not moving from here. Me neither. <sighs> I can't do it without the rest. <laughs> okay, okay. Dina, what's the matter? It's almost perfect. Almost perfect is not enough for the baby sort of song. Hmm. I'll go with her. Come on, Nara. Dina! Where is she? She's very weird with all this song thing. Why is it so important to her? Huh? What is that? This way, Nara. <gasps> How cool! A magic sword. I'm sure Dina will love it. Uh, wow, I'm strong. Huh? Uh, it'll be Nessie nice doing his stuff. Come on, Nara. They'll be amazed. Back to the rehearsal. And with her sword, she tried to close it. But she disappeared and came back to her world. Babies, babies, babies. Hey, look what I just found. A sword, like in the song. <gasps> Whoa. Wow. No, it can't be. No. But what's up now with Dina? She's acting in a very strange ah. way. Huh? Mine, mine, ah. mine. Ah. Who's that baby? <sighs> She's so, so beautiful. Hmm. You take sword, Stella. Now fantasy world, boom! She said that something is gonna explode in the fantasy world. Will it be a balloon? <laughs> Danger! Magic of the world! Help! Is it a riddle? Their costume is so cool. I love it. No costume. Stella wants adventurers. Adventurers will save fantasy world. I'm a strong adventurer. I'll show you. Uh. Uh. Ha! Mm, okay. Adventurers United! Adventurers Pink! Wow! Wow! wow. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Objects, magic, worlds, fantasy, boom! Tina! They took the sword of our friend Stella! Our friend Stella we have to find, because I can tell something's not fine. Fantasy world will fall apart. We must do something, but where should we start? How, How many, many worlds, worlds are there? Storyland, Tutti Fruity Bay, 
Baby Bottle Valley, and Fantasy World. Four magic of each world or Fantasy World, boom! Explosion! It seems to me that the special pacifiers of each world are the key. Let's go to Bottle Valley. We need help. Hey! Huh? Tina? Dina? Stella? It's been a long time. They know each other? I don't know. Stella, miss you. Ah! There's no time to lose. The four special pacifiers we must obtain. Or we won't see Fantasy World again. Let's go! Uh, uh, we need the golden pacifier. Oh, bring it back, huh? Yes, magic. More pacifiers. We must get the rest of the special pacifiers quickly. Run, run! Help! Help! Ah! Hold on! Help! Ah! Don't let me go! Day. <laughs> Very good, Bruni. Tina, just a little more. Dottie, you're doing great. Come on, babies. We have to celebrate the balloon party. Hey, that one's flying away. Did it blow away? Hey, they're leaving. Balloons, come back. The party is here. It's the book. It attracts the balloons. Something's going on in Storyland, and this is getting out of hand. Let's go and see what's happening. Once upon a time, there was a happy baby, very busy with a party that she celebrated daily. The balloons we must chase if we want to solve this case. Mm. Huh? I can't wait to discover which our next adventure will be. Hey, huh? we're not done yet. Come back. Look, who is she? Mm. Don't leave. Hi, I'm Dottie. What's your name? Alice. What's wrong? Why are you sad? Because I have no one to celebrate my unbirthday with. Is there anything worse than spending your unbirthday alone? Unbirthday? If your birthday is the day when you were born, your unbirthday is? Every other day of the year. And your friend? I don't know. Robbie always comes to my parties, but today she hasn't come. Huh? huh? At last, Rabbit, why are you so late? Rabbit, enough! How are we going to celebrate my own birthday with that long face? Don't worry, Alice. We'll celebrate with you. We have to sing happy birthday. Mm -hmm. But it's happy unbirthday. Okay, I'll sing it! <gasps> we wish you a very happy, happy, happy unbirthday. It's so great to celebrate mm. it every single day. What do you want, Rabbi? Not now. Don't you see what It's a celebration. Come on, sing with us. Time for our creation. It causes a sensation. Causes a sensation. It's so great to celebrate it every single day. Not every day, except one. And what do I celebrate that day? You, you celebrate, celebrate your, your birthday. birthday. Oh, but we can't eat the cake without blowing out the candles first. <gasps> Hmm. Blow them out and don't mess about. We'll help you. <laughs> Bravo. Awesome. Huh? They don't blow out? Try harder. <laughs> huh? My cake. Oh, almost. <laughs> Again, Rabbi? Don't you see I'm busy? There's nothing more important than my own birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the party going! Oh, Alice, we've been celebrating the whole day. We have to go home and sleep. But you can't go yet. Look how many presents still need to be opened. Oh my gosh, too many. We won't have enough time to open all of them before your birthday ends. What if we celebrate something else? My own birthday never ends because every huh? day is my own birthday. <laughs> Huh? Where are you going in such a hurry? And where did you get all that from? Okay, mm. how many consecutive unbirthdays have you celebrated? Mm, I don't know. I lost count. But what I know is that I'll celebrate the next hundred with you. A hundred more? 
That's too much for huh? me. Come on, babies. Dotty, huh? sing another song. Uh, I have run out of ideas. We have to blow out the magic candles. They never blow out. Bruni, use your bubbles to set the teacups. Cups? You mean those over <laughs> there? Hey, my cups! <laughs> Let's go, now that she's distracted. Run! Hey, where are you going? No one leaves my own birthday so easily. My cake! <laughs> but, Rabby, those are my things. I don't understand why you don't want to celebrate my own birthday with me. <laughs> don't you see? It's Rabby's birthday. That's why he was trying to get your attention. Oh, I feel terrible. I'm so selfish thinking just about myself. Of course there's something more important than my own birthday. Your birthday! Here, my presents are for you. Yay! Yay! <laughs> That's how Alice's story ends. She learned an important lesson and made some good friends. What a beautiful adventure! Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Not this, not that, uh, not this. Huh? Wow, beautiful. You look wonderful, Lulu. <laughs> Let me have it. Yeah, it's a beautiful cape. Oh. Whose might it be? I think it belongs to a granny. No way. Huh? It's from a flying wolf. <laughs> super wolf! Yeah. yeah, right, super wolf. <laughs> Don't you remember? It's from a tail. The giant baby doll's handkerchief. <laughs> Let me try it. Tell us, tell us. A rabbit! Do you see it? No, let me have it. I want to see it. Me too. It. I'm next. Well, I see the shadow of a baby with a super cool hat. Ooh. It's not a baby. It's a gorgeous house. It's my turn. Now I see, is that Super Wolf? Why is it wearing a grandma's nightgown? <sighs> it looks like this cape belongs to a baby. Well, we have to find out whose it is. Hmm. And whose could it be? <gasps> Tina! If you don't wait for your turn to speak, I'll be clueless for a week. We found this cape in my trunk, but uh, uh, we don't know who it belongs to. It's magical, try ah. it! Wow, what a cool magical cape. From my crystal ball, it won't escape. Uh -huh. It's a duck or a swan. Huh? Sharp in the eye, <gasps> it's a rainbow I look upon. Maybe the baby lives there. Let's go! <laughs> wow! I love Rainbow Lake! But it looks like no one lives there. And there's no duck, nor a swan, not even a rainbow. We must look for the baby in the lake, and then we'll understand the mystery of the cape. In the lake, but inside or outside? Low or high, it's a baby, not a fly. Okay, you have no idea. We'll look in pairs. Connie, you come with me. And I'll be with Dottie. Oh, whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I can't with you. Shh, I heard something. There's someone over there. We, we got, got you, baby! Oh, five more minutes. She doesn't change. Uh, but it was another sound. Uh, I don't know. Huh? Come on, babies! Where are you going? That way! Where? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> You. I'm Sydney, guard and protector of the rainbow and all of its stories. But uh, what are you all doing here? It's just that I found this cool cape, but we still don't know whose it is. We just want to return it to the baby. It's very special. It gives us vision. Familiar? Weird? Incredible? That's, That's it, it. Yeah. yeah! They're things from a wonderful land. I think I can help you. Would you give it to me? This cape is not a regular cape. You'll see. Hold on! I've lost control! Ah. That was close! Yes. Oof. Uh, 
but that book? Don't trip or lose your shoe. Bring down the book for me to view. Uh. Ooh. Ooh. Wow! That book will take you to the owner of the red cape. Besides that, she misses it very much. Now he must continue the journey on your own. Wow. wow! Many, many years ago, all the babies from the tail and the valley used to live in peace. But the babies from the valley stopped ah. reading, and little by little, they began to forget their favorite characters and their tales until they almost disappeared. Oh, no! That's why the book's pages are blank, right? Like Sydney. But now you can solve this because every day you'll live a tale, and with the story, a new book will prevail. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, wow! It's a new land. Look, over there. It's like the book from the lake. Will the cape baby live here? Where will those roads lead? Look carefully Whoa. at the sign and you'll know where to go. Every road is a tale that you'll be able to live. 